Hey, I'm Alan Reynolds with Southland Organics. I wanted to do a short video today on how to spray Litter Life. One of the benefits to Litter Life is that you can actually put it out yourself. You don't need an applicator or some type of certification to put it out, you can put Litter Life. But one of the questions people ask a lot is how do I do it? I've only got a 25 gallon tank on the back of my four wheeler or I've got a 500 gallon uh, house washer. Perfect. Let me give you another idea on how to, how to do this. Uh, we've had a, had a couple of growers who actually showed us how they were using a 250 gallon tote. So what you're going to do on a 250 gallon tote is, and I'm going to show you pictures of some of these fittings. Basically you want to get an adapter, about a two inch adapter, either coarse or fine thread to go on the end of that tote. And then get a fitting, a reducer, and then get a fitting that'll go to a garden hose. I'll show you the parts that you need shortly. But as you can see, you're going to run that garden hose from that tote to that pressure washer. You've got your trailer, pull the trailer behind your tractor through there. And as uh, our guy right here is just actually spraying a field, you can actually see that, man, you can just get it out. You could use a squirt gun if you had to, but just get a wide end nozzle and just get this application down. One gallon of litter life with nine gallons of water will cover 2,000 square feet. So for a 20,000 square foot house, you want to put in 10 gallons with 90 gallons of water. Spray it out. Another video I've shown actually what it's doing in the house. Guy walking on the back. You could actually spray a 20,000 square foot house. You should be able to do it in about 15 minutes as long as you've got these parts. And a lot of you guys on the farm are going to have a pressure washer and probably a tote. So anyway, hope this helps. We're going to bring another video um, in part two of this to show you actually how to use maybe a pressure washer and something else on when you're using a boom applicator. So anyway, hope this helps. If you got any questions, give us a call.